that's so error 404 page not found like things are crashing all of those are just thoughts and a feeling is just a vibration in your body it can't hurt you it's not real it might have uh maybe gone wrong but um you don't know what you're going to do with it tomorrow you don't know what um you're going to do with that it may be um something did go, go terribly wrong and maybe you got massively embarrassed or you lost a lot of money or um you hurt somebody or broke a relationship um but I think it's really important to tap into uh, what did you learn from that? What can I go? What can I do? Where can I go from here? And just knowing, just wrapping that right back around to, okay, X, Y, Z just happened. You're going to have thoughts about it, which is going to create a lot of feelings about that. And then you can say, okay, what is my next right step? How do I get to where I'm going from here? This might have been a huge setback. Maybe my next right step is to recoup. Maybe my next right step is to brainstorm. Um, the next right step doesn't always have to be forward motion. It okay, could be that's a good one. Um, go ahead. That sounds really good. What do you mean by that? So the next right step could just be sitting down and doing uh, another brainstorming session. What did I learn? What am I thinking? What do I need to do next? So it's, it's like discovering that um, how, how do I move forward? So I think it's just removing that pressure from yourself that forward always means like this cute little avatar, upward, onward, smile on our face, and life is great. And even the person sitting in the chair is like calm and thoughtful and she's looking up. But progress doesn't always go like that, right? It's pitfalls and it's, um, you know, swimming through the mud. But you have to kind of anticipate that you'll have those moments and to be okay with things crashing down or things going wrong. And understand that that doesn't necessarily mean anything about the end journey. Unless if you stop and you make it mean something, it could just be a pivot. Where are you going now? What are you going to do with this? Okay, you say you say the word pivot. I love it. So a person may need to pivot. They may need to regroup. They may need to do some of the things you mentioned earlier uh, others, you may uh, be joining us just now, uh, but a point was made earlier that a person may need to reassess, as it were, where they are. They may need to sit down and take a look at where they are. Uh, it may mean you may need to talk to someone, but still visualize your goal. Yeah. I would say never lose sight of your goal, because at one point it was important uh, for you to have that outcome and there's probably you know if things crash there's that ache in your soul that says i'm not realizing that today so the the goal is still there what you're visualizing is still there you just may have to have a different um, method of getting there a different vehicle maybe or maybe even a different velocity. Maybe you're going at a different rate of speed. Mm -hmm. Maybe you have to go right. slower for a little while. Right. You know, mm -hmm. it's Which not always it's not always going to be that upward forward motion. But just kind of like what you were saying, 
um, checking in with yourself, but also checking in with somebody else, like an amazing life coach. I think it's so important to um, take not only the growth moments, the intentional moments to say, where do I want to go and how do I plan to get there? But also take those moments where, you know, you do have setbacks to recoup and figure out what happened and why did I do it that way? Um, And what are my thoughts about that to sit down with somebody and get that reflection to just figure out um, where you're at right now to get some clarity and that's what good coaches will do for you is uh, to mirror back to you. It's not just what happened. It's like, where where's your thought process? What are your thoughts about that? And it's your thoughts that will affect how you feel and move forward. So as long as you want to like keep moving forward, you have to make sure that you assess what your thoughts are about it. Do you think they need to go and get a hoodie? Yes. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Especially one like that. That one is sassy. That one's got some that one's got some pizzazz. You got just start thug. But I love things like this, like merchandise. Just like uh, a hoodie. Especially something like this if you are uh, hunkering down and brainstorming and you want something comfortable or even if you're like losing weight and you just need that little motivation. This is like one of those visualized <laughs> visualization exercises. It's like, I am just going to start today. Whatever it is, we're just starting. Look at you. Look at you. You're... Bro, we're going to put a link down. We need to put a link to my oh, shop. Yeah. There's more than just hoodies on there. Oh, really? We've got coffee mugs. We've got oh. leggings. We've got um, backpacks. I really love the backpack, by the way. It's so cute. Okay. I was actually thinking about this. I'm glad you asked me. And no this telling, is going to... No telling what I'll ask. There, so... <laughs> you never tell me what you're going to ask me. <laughs> hey, that's why I should have known you did this at the last show. For two years. They don't want to be bored and, and, you know, we look too prepared. Then they bored. Go ahead. Okay. So this is, I'm just going to give you your affirmation because I'm into affirmations. On YouTube, I posted a self-confidence affirmation uh, for your daily to listen to, whatever. Um, (laughs) So I'm going to give you an affirmation for today because I'm on this kick. You are amazing and worthy. And I want you to go and create something beautiful today. I want you to believe that. That, was and that goes back to your individual worth thing that we were talking about earlier. But I want you to believe that you are amazing and worthy. Of course. <laughs> I'm very inspiring. You can get it from my merch line. You can get it from my YouTube. You can get it from my Instagram channel. Or you can just message me <laughs> and we'll have fun. Hey, we'll, we'll have a session together. 